We'll do the relaxation app here. Okay, so for the benefit of the viewers, that relaxation um, video or app was eight minutes long and we just showed a few seconds in the video here. We're doing many things to try to put you and keep you in the right mind. In reality, we're in and out of our right mind all the time. All the time, you know. Yeah. So we're just trying to do things to promote that. Okay, now I want you to do the drawing circles into the air. Not too fast, yep. Mm-hmm. Now this one will also be a bit of a different one. When I ask you to change the direction of your left hand, I want you actually to keep your attention on the right hand. Oh. Okay, so keep your attention focusing on keeping that one going around, but in the back of your mind, off in the distance, then change the direction of your left hand. When I say, so keeping the attention on your right hand Change your left hand motion. <laughs> That's more difficult. Okay, yeah, exactly. So we're really, really trying to promote connections to the right brain. Okay, now we're going to do the opposite. Keep the attention always on your left hand. So in your mind, be always concentrating on your left hand. Huh. And so... Change the direction of your left hand. Great. Okay, now what I want you to do is put your attention over at the kitchen and change the direction of your left hand. Did you find that easier? Yeah, it was. Okay. For some reason. I think this is very similar to when I learned to ride a motorcycle. And they had pylons, uh -huh. and they said drive between the pylons, like alternating around them, without hitting them. Yeah. And everybody in our class hit and knocked over the pylons. Then, and everybody was saying, oh man, this is just too difficult, I'll never learn to do this. Uh -huh. Right away, the teacher said, okay, you see those trees about 300 feet away? Yeah. Everybody look over there and focus your attention there and drive through the pylons. Uh -huh. Everybody did it immediately. Yeah. yeah. So I think there's a bit of a phenomenon like that operating here. Kind of like sailing. People get seasick when they're focusing on the boat. Mm. And when you tell them to look at the horizon and then their stomach settles down. There you go. I want you to create some energy in your hands. Okay, and feel the heat. Let's see, your left hand to your left cheek of your face. And feel the heat. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that's a right brain activity. Mm -hmm. And I want you to just tap your cheek with your fingers. As if you're playing the piano or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, and your ear too. Mm -hmm. Okay, and hear that sound mm -hmm. in your ear. Okay, so these will be all right brain things. Mm -hmm. Okay, and now I want you to... Uh, close your uh, right nostril with your right hand and just be breathing. And, and the idea here, once again, is studies have shown that this helps to access the right brain. And just breathe slowly in and out. Get yourself totally relaxed. And while you're doing that, I want you to do the shifty eye thing. Slowly move the eyes back and forth at a spot on the left and right of the mask. Once again, this is an exercise that can also bring us into our right brain. And now I want you to go up and down. Look up to the top and down to the bottom. Go back a few times. Okay, and now I want you to go counterclockwise. This is different. And now I want you to go clockwise. And now what I'd like you to do is a Z pattern or Z pattern. So go across the top, then right across to the bottom left-hand side as if you're drawing a Z, and then back again. So just draw a Z or Z a few times with your eyes. Okay, now I want you to draw a backward Z or Z. So just go the opposite way. 
to the bottom and then back up to the top. Okay, and now I just want you to make a box. So a square box going across, down, back across on the bottom, and back up. And just stop each time drawing a box for several times. Okay, and just relax. You can, yep, yeah, just take a deep breath in. Okay, and I want you to ball up any stress or tension or all thoughts that you have at the moment. Just figuratively and symbolically put everything together, roll it all up into a ball, okay, and toss it all the way out. Yeah, just toss it. And I want you to visualize yourself in the moment. You're right here, right now, safe in your home. You're in the moment, right in this second. And we're just moving second by second, right in this moment in time. We're in the moment, dynamically in the moment. And I want you to see yourself as just a passive observer. And I want you to move away from any thoughts, judgment, ideas, criticism, opinions. And I want you to just suspend all of that. That's a left brain activity. I want you to go into more right brain activity where you're just observing and taking in your surroundings by the moment, you know, hearing sounds that might be going on, whether it's me speaking, whether it's the birds outside, whether it's the wind, just everything that's happening right now in the moment. Anything that's happening that ends in the word ing, like anybody talking, the birds singing, you're listening, uh, you're sitting, you're observing. So all the ing words. So ing words are things that are happening in the moment. I want you to be strictly in the moment. And if any thoughts come into your head, things that occur to you, you know, just say to yourself, that's nice. And don't give it any more attention. Just let it go. Don't try to hang on to any thoughts. But, you know, don't try to push them out too hard either. Just, you're just an observer. They're just there. It's just like watching a movie. Uh, you know, the ideas are presented by the moment in the moment on an ongoing basis and you just see them and you just keep moving through the movie. And that's what we're doing right now. We're just in the moment. Okay, so let every bit of your body relax from head to toe, loosen your shoulders, loosen your legs, just be like a rag doll sitting in the bench and just be in the moment. And once again, you're a human being, so I just want you to be. Not a human doing, a human being. <laughs> you know, so much of the time we're human doings. Do, 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 do. And that's okay, we need to do things. But at the moment, and the session we're in, I want you to be nothing more than a human being. A sentient human being that is observing and feeling and sensing its surroundings. And that's it, nothing more. And allow yourself to just connect to the universe, to these other fields that are all around us. So grab the one that's on the bottom in front of me. This one? The one in front of me, yep, and put the others back. Okay. Let your internal light shine out and look for any spots of light, your channels of seeing. Okay. I can see the E just in a tiny little spot on this side now, but it's not as bright. This side is really bright and magnified. Okay, good. Uh, it's almost like I see a just a, a, a spot of light. That's okay. all I can see right there is a okay. spot of light. That's the only way I can explain it. Just to vary it up a bit. And that one on the very top in front of you. Yeah, and put the rest away. And move that right on top of your head. And put it, and likely you already have the color then. Orange? Yep, it's that yellowy orange color, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Now when you move it to the left side, 
near the back, does it show the color? The spot's gone. Oh. The spot of light's gone. Okay. Well, it may come back later. You know, these windows seem to open and close at random. Yeah, they do. Okay, so just go through and I'll find you a good one. Okay, let's take that one. This one? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, and put it sort of back behind your ear a little bit and see if you can see something back there. See what you might find. I can see the brightness. Mm-hmm. And I see, and, it's, and it feels like um, the spot right here, it feels like there's an opening. Oh, it's really, really bright right there. Okay, concentrate yeah. on that spot and move it around slowly in that area and see if the black comes into focus a little bit. The black that's on the sheet. Okay, now move around to the front and see how many windows you have open in the front now. I have that one and it's an N. Yeah. And I have that one. Mm -hmm. When you see, do you see it here or do you see it here? I see it to the back. I see it right against the side of my vision. Okay. And that's when all the weird stuff happens where it moves in the opposite direction as what I'm moving it and so on. Were you, were you dizzy last time? A little bit, yeah. Right I had to have a little nap. Is I there... can see a spot. I mm -hmm. can see a spot of light. Okay, look into that spot of light and move the card very slowly around that and see if you can scan the letter. It's a very tiny spot. Mm-hmm. Very, very, oh. There you go. It just opened for a second and then closed. Mm-hmm. Let that open a bit. Let's grab another card. Okay. We'll just do something different here for a second. Okay, grab that letter, yes. Mm -hmm. Now find that spot. Move your card out a bit into the sun. Weirdest feeling because it's kind of like it opens close. Mm -hmm. It kind of does that. Yeah. And for, for a second I think I see it and then it's gone. Try to find that little pinhole and go out that pinhole and look. Let it open. It, the, the sensation was that open, like it was like the room's there, gone. Mm -hmm. that, that was the sensation I got just, just suddenly, boom. Okay. Yeah. Well, we're going to work on this over the coming days. See my hand, if I can see the sheet. Mm -hmm. Looking for that letter. Just be in the moment. Right in the here and now. That's in the sun right there. Right there, it seems really bright. Right it there. is. Right there, it's in the sun, but nowhere different. As soon as you move it, it's out of the sun. Right there. Yeah. Okay, let's grab a color to do something different here. Okay. Okay, that one. That one. Yeah, and you're right here. Yep. Yeah. Put it on okay. top of your head. And let's just see. Are you still there? Yep. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. Look up in the blackness of your mask mm -hmm. and look for the color of that. It seems like it's yellow. Yeah, it is. It's yellowy it's green. Bright, bright. It's like the sun shining on me.